All right, the girth and prosec. Uh, these are both hitches, which means that they take the form of the thing that we're tying them around. Um, and the prosec is just an advanced form of a girth hitch, basically. So if I have a little loop, um, my prosec loop here, sometimes we call this a waist loop, whatever, but my little uh, short prosec loop, um, I can take this and um, put one side of that around and feed the other through it. Um, and I've made sure to do so so that the knot isn't in the middle of my girth hitch here and it also isn't at the other end that I clip. Um, that's just a girth hitch. Um, and the girth hitch isn't especially useful around a piece of rope like this, but the girth hitch can be really useful, um, very useful uh, to connect a lot of other things. And we want to connect this in places where we don't have a lot of movement. So for instance, if I want to take the fixed end of my Purcell Prusik and put that into my harness, um, then I can connect myself and use this as a lanyard to connect myself to um, anchors and things like that. That can be a great way to use a girth hitch. Um, but for the girth hitch that's on my cord over here, um, so I've wrapped around one direction, then I'll just keep wrapping in that same direction and make sure that I go underneath this little bridge for a second wrap. And then I'll do a third wrap here. And as I start to do a third wrap, um, then this is a three wrap prosec giving me a six pack of donuts. And this not actually, this hitch actually does have to be uh, dressed. And dressed for this looks like the two strands that come in are parallel and start in the middle of this six pack of donuts. They wrap out each side, they wrap out on each side, and then each side uh, forms the bridge from one side to the other there. We can see the bridge going all the way across. Uh, and of course also the knot cannot be anywhere in here and this is probably best if it's not at the clip-in point at the other end here. Uh, the point of the Prusik is that it'll slide easily on a piece of cord, um, but then if we let, cinch it down and uh, pull on it, then it grabs nicely as well. The difference in diameter between the host material and the Prusik material, as well as the suppleness of the material, um, will determine how well it grabs. Um, but we basically use it as a rope grab that's able to slide and then also grab.